Hello, wonderful people, viewers, and subscribers. Welcome back on this platform, BVI Channel One, where truth is the gospel we preach. Now, let me say this as a disclaimer: that this video is not in any way meant to ridicule any man of God, specifically W. F. Kumuyi. You know why I'm saying this? There is this video that is online. Something happened a couple of weeks ago. I think about a week, where W. F. Kumuyi um, appeared on Christmas Carol he attended in Asurok. He sparked a lot of controversy. Somebody say louder, Amen. Your Excellencies, it is a very great honor to invite to the podium the General Superintendent of the Deeper Christian Life ministry pastor wf kumuhi may we please put our hands together as he gives us the word the word for this 2021 state house christmas season we may please rise in honor to the word of the lord we are about to receive and to the great servant of the lord please let's continue to applaud until he stands behind the pulpit you're welcome our father in the lord Praise the Lord. Father, we thank you for this hour. Thank you for this time. Thank you for the worship. Thank you for all the Bible readings. We're asking, Lord, that tonight, in the brief moment we have, you speak to every heart in Jesus' name. Bless everyone, Lord. In Jesus' name, we pray. And some people had come out to defend him as usual. You know, some people who are so religious-minded saying that the man of God had never, ever condemned Christmas carol or Christmas. But we have some record for you to watch. I'll be right back. People, you've gone astray, come. My people, you've gone back into the world, come. My people, all the appearances of Egypt and the celebration of Egypt is now upon you, come now, my people. And all the merriments and all the drinking and all the, you know, all the festivals of Christmas. By the way, you, you, I think you ought to know we, we never, never cease this the ministry started we have never said we're going to christmas retreat never we don't celebrate christmas it actually came from idolatrous background and that's why you never find us in this church singing what they call christmas carols never we always say it's december retreat it's a december getting together just december we're just gathering together because of the holiday period so that we can reconnect ourselves to the lord more and we can give everything we have to the lord more when you find any section of the church anybody coming in and wants to introduce the idolatry of mystery babylon that they call christmas good now if you take a look at that very um, Christmas carol he attended in Nasarok. Okay, he didn't say anything wrong. There was no controversial statement in his preaching. He's a man I respect so much. He's a man of God I respect so much. And the anointing behind him. Okay, but sometimes we misplace church doctrine we misplace church doctrine and try to use it to take the place of the bible standard that is what i've always preached right from time in case you don't know i was born and bred by a bible believing family in fact the first text i read as a child was the bible tutored by whom everyone know as god's general may the soul of my dad rest in peace because he granted us to understand the difference between religion and true christianity and that is what i preach you see when you follow human doctrine 
you are bound to make mistakes because it will continue to change and contradict each other. But God's word doesn't contradict itself or change because truth will always remain the truth. It doesn't change. Now, there are a couple of issues that had happened. Even my well-respected aunt, she is a deeper lifer. In fact, a high-ranking deeper lifer. That's the ones in the Hana Kumu Yini Likon Nino Fefere. I stayed with her. And many like her We are groomed by my own father too. So I understand the principle of, the, of God's word and church doctrine. I know the difference. Now, you all know that Deeper Life never believed in technology, especially television. They called it something else. And church workers are not permitted to have one in their houses. But today, Deeper Life has modified, and today they even have a television station. That is the difference between church doctrine and Christian standard or biblical standard. That is why I tell you, no matter whom or where you worship with, Please always make the Bible your standard and not church doctrine because it can change anytime. Kumuyi, seven years ago, preached against Christmas carol. But today, he's attending Christmas carol. And some people who are throwing punches at him are saying, okay, why would he go there? Okay, even if he go there, it's because he's, you know, the government people, you know, that kind of a thing. Going to Asoro, where the powers that be. That is why he goes. And he will not even go there to tell them that Christmas celebration or Carol is sinful. That was what I've been showing. But that is not what I'm here to say. What I'm here to say is that make Bible your standard and not your church doctrine. That is my stand. And I believe it is clearer now. Makandena Bom unbeliever. I am not sentimental. I am not emotional. I am here to deliver service and it is ordained by God. It is divine. To be honest with you, if I'm to choose what to be doing for my people, this will be the least. But I just have to because this is a calling and it didn't start today. Thank you and thank God for giving me faith to be an instrument to educate and inform my people using this platform. And to you, thank you for always watching and dropping your comments. Please continue bringing it on. The forming a very formidable society that will transform our lives and make it good and worthwhile to live in. Thank you. God bless you.